Hey everyone, World Born is Jade, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we have another fun with index video for you, so you know it is Saturday. This is number three, so let's go. <music> All right, and I will be using the reverse today. I'm using the blank page, the blank side on it. One is ruled, one is blank. I'll be using the blank side today. The supplies are pretty limited. You don't need a whole ton. I will be using a pencil. I will be using a pin and an eraser. And a little phrase from the word and phrase principle that I have on my website. So right now I'm just drawing a cup first. I do a circle, like an oval, on an angle, and then I just made some shallow seas, if you could call that, for the size of a mug or a cup that I'm just drawing on the handle. And now I'm drawing on the frosting on the top. So we're doing a cup bake in a cup, which is a mug bake which I absolutely love. Listen, when I first found out about my cake, now let me tell you, I made all the mug, the mug cakes. I made them in the morning just because. And what I always did, I always had frosting in my freezer, so I would make butter cream from scratch, and I'd always have that in the freezer. So whenever I want a cake, a mug cake, or if I'm baking, I always have icing on pie. <laughs> I know, I love cake. And I love homemade cakes. You know, they're so yummy. So now I'm just drawing in some meltage that is going on. This is some chocolate that has been melted and it's just dripping over the side. Obviously, this stuff it has no color because. It has no color. <laughs> I'm just drawing it in. Then I'm going to be drawing on some sprinkles onto the cupcake because I like the touch of the sprinkles. But before I do that, I'm just erasing some of the guidelines that I had in just so I don't get confused. Um, what I like to do as soon as I have my guides down, once I have did that section, I like to just put in the guides just so I do not get confused because it happens. It has, it has happened to me before, let me tell you. And it was like an awkward because I actually used the pin over the guides when I did it, but not get it out. So now I just erase some more of the guideline and I am going over with the pin. This pen was supposed to be permanent, but it is not so permanent. Or I just don't know if it is the type of um, texture or whatnot on the index card, but it wasn't permanent. My idea, as you will see soon, was to draw and then I'll just do some smooshing with that acetate and markers like I always do. However, we went into a pop, a catastrophic dilemma, problem, okay? Making started quickly, we want some mess. I had to combine on the first one. So this is actually the second. <laughs> I did this before and I had to like do it all over again. So yeah. That happened. <laughs> However, you know what? We are not going to cry and be sitting here in Jamaica. We are not going to have a spill milk, what is done is done. And we did it all over again. I won't say the first one looked better than this one though. But like, here, I don't care. The fact of the matter is, is that we got it done and it's completed. Alrighty. Let's go into the shading. No, I'm just using the same pen that's supposed to get permanent ink to do some etching on the side of the mug, 
on the icing, you know, where the shadows would be. So my light source is coming from where the handle of the cup is. And so then wherever there would be shadowing, I didn't do all of it, but just wherever I did some sh shading, I did some edge marks. I like to do edge marks, that kind of thing. Um, this pen is not that kind, so I, and it bled. Like I said, I don't know, it bleeds a lot, so if the pen tip touched the paper for too long, it starts bleeding. So I had to move really fast. Now you're going to see what I was talking about, how this ink bled all over my cup. But no worry, we will not fret. Now we are sticking down a phrase which says, Treat yourself. I don't know why that was so hard for me to say. Treat yourself. All right, guys, if you enjoyed this, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing. If you haven't heard, I will be on the Fruit of the Spirit Bible Journaling Conference. And I would love for you to join me. The link is in the description down below. It is absolutely free. But there is also the option to upgrade to lifetime access. And you get a huge discount if you do that before the actual event. So you're getting it for $29.99. So if you would love to be a part of this conference, go ahead and register yours truly will be on the first day. And thank you so much for watching. If you see the mistake that I made, let me know in the comments down below. And it's not so much of a mistake to be honest. Um, it just, I did a little of the shading accidentally off camera. That's it. <laughs>